how does a dana cell work dana cell consists of two half cells oxidation half cell and reduction half cell at zinc electrode the zinc atoms being highly electropositive loses two electrons that is undergoes oxidation and they by forms zinc ions shown as zn2+ which enter into the solution that is oxidation reaction occurs at zinc half cell over a period of time with the loss of zinc atoms as zinc ions the mass of zinc electrode decreases the two electrons liberated from the zinc atoms travels through external circuit through platinum wire and finally reaches copper electrode of copper half cell here in this half cell the cupric ion shown as cu2+ accepts two electrons received from the zinc anode and thereby gets converted into copper cu that is reduction reaction occurs at copper electrode over a period of time due to the deposition of more copper atoms all over the electrode the mass of copper electrode increases zinc electrode with excess electrons has got high electrode potential while copper with less electron pool has got lower electrode potential as a result of this the potential difference arises and thus the electrons tend to flow from the region of high potential that is zinc electrode to the region of lower potential that is copper electrode at the oxidation half cell the zinc metal oxidizes to zinc ion by losing two electrons while the cupric ion reduces to copper by accepting two electrons at reduction half cell both the oxidation and reduction half cell reactions of dana cell may be represented as shown on adding both the half cell reactions and by cancelling common terms that is two electrons lying in the opposite ends of two half cell reactions we get the net or overall cell reaction for daniel cell